Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I want to teach you how to play the fairy tale final season opening called The Power of the Dream. Okay, so here we go. Be teaching you two sections in this song. Both sections are my favorite sections. First section is the chorus section, and then the second section is the awesome catchy instrumental that plays throughout the song as well. Okay, but anyway, give you a preview of both sections before we start learning it. It goes like this. Chorus section goes like this. It's the instrumental section. It goes like this. Give you a preview. So I like this section. It's really catchy. It's like. Repeat. Okay, let's get right into both sections right now. So learn the first section first, okay? Here we go. Let's break this up into, let me see, uh, two parts is easier to learn, okay? So here we go. First part goes like this, right hand, starts on the G here, middle C is here for reference. We go by an octave to the C. This is the G that we start on here. So G, F sharp, D, F sharp, G, F sharp, G, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, D, E, D, 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 C, B, C, B. That's it for the first part for the right hand, okay? One more time, so it goes like this. G, F sharp, D, F sharp, G, F sharp, G, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, D, E, D, 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 C, B, C, B. That's it for the right hand for this first part. Once you get the right hand there, left hand, we have four chords here. Four chords are a very important four chords because these four chords are actually the same four chords in both sections and both parts of both sections. Okay, so anyways, yeah, the four chords are C major, which is C E G, it's a fully white note chord. Second chord is also a fully white note chord, is G major, which is G B D. Third chord to E minor, oh I'm sorry, D major, which is D F sharp A. And then the fourth chord then is E minor, okay, which is a fully white note chord, E G B. Okay, so with these four chords in mind, so C major, G major, D major, and E minor, the two hands together goes like this. Okay, right hand starts first, up to F sharp, C major by itself, G and G major get up, up to D, D major by itself, up to C, E minor by itself, like that, okay, and that's the first part. One more time, it goes like this, here. Once you get the first part, let's move on to the second part of this uh, section, okay? Right hand continues, it's like similar, the first half of it is actually pretty much similar. I, I, I'll show you, okay? So this second part is, is pretty much nearly the same as the first part for the first, uh, about nearly uh, three quarters. Check it out, so it's like same here, same, same, same. So after the D's here is where we change, right hand goes E, F sharp, F sharp, and then after F sharp, E minor by itself, a chord, on the left hand, and then right hand, two Gs, like that. So it's only the last five notes on the right hand's different. So it's like da 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 da, is these five notes that's different, okay? Instead of doing C, B, C, B, it's E, F, G, da da, like that. So substitute those last four notes of the first part for the, uh, for the five notes that we just did. Okay, so yeah, hope you got that pattern because it allows you to learn a lot quicker by understanding what's the same and what's not, so you can save some time not like just learning something completely uh, new again. Okay, but anyways, yeah, okay, second part one more time. So first three quarters the same, like this. Same, same. After the D's changes, E, F sharp, F sharp, E minor, G, G, like that. Just like that, okay? So remember that. So back to back, the two parts of this section will be played like this. Check it out. And that's it. Simple stuff. 
okay, and then just repeat this section, okay, but anyway, let's now move on to the second section, okay, the second section, I like this, it's really catchy, okay, as I said before, anyway, so here we go, it's pretty easy, because the right hand is like this motive, play twice, and then like with the chords, okay, so all we need to do is learn the right hand here, okay, so here we go, it goes G, G, D, G, G, up to the higher D, B, A, G, G, D, G, that's it for the right hand, okay, Remember this motif, okay? One more time, it goes like this. G, G, D, G, G, higher D, B, A, G, G, D, G. Okay, so that's the right hand motif. You just have to play it twice, okay? Left hand, same four chords again, as I said before, in the other section. So C major, C, G, G major, G, B, D, D major, D, F sharp, A, and E minor, E, G, B. So you have all these four chords in mind. Let's hands together, it goes like this. So right hand's playing that motif for two times. The so G and C major together. G and G major together. And then do the same motive again, but this time with a D major with the G. And then the G and E minor this time together. Like that, and you just repeat it. So like this. Awesome. Like that, okay, repeat. That's pretty much it. It's very simple stuff, okay? So after you got both sections out of the way, then, uh, like all the melody and chords and all the rhythm very good, then you can start to add other improvisation and decoration patterns to make it more interesting and awesome, okay? So you can be like, uh, left hand can be like more octave and arpeggio patterns, right hand can harmonize it, okay? You can do something like this. Uh, let me see. Oh yeah, it's like this. Okay, but anyways, that's pretty much it. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Uh, if you like these type of step-by-step -step piano tutorial, check out the rest of my channel because literally I have multiple thousands and thousands and thousands of other videos like these who are to enjoy and learn from. So so much stuff for you to check out. But anyway, also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn how to play by ear, improvise, read sheet music, play and sing, and a lot of other cool stuff. So go ahead, check that out for yourself as well. And yeah, as for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you time. Thanks for watching. For those who want to learn my methods on how to play any song by ear, grab the free preview of my book. Or just visit my website bestpianomethod.com for all my other piano mastery courses, sheet music, song requests and services. All the links are in the description below. See you next time.